There's a new tech war brewing in the United States, and it's fueled by billions of dollars, national energy security, and the massive egos of companies convinced that they can reinvent nuclear power. It's the race to deploy the first game-changing advanced reactor. Each company in the race believes that they've designed the best model out there and have amassed billions of startup dollars thanks to hungry investors. But it doesn't matter which plan sounds the best. Who's actually gonna get it approved and built first? Let's spend a few videos looking at their timelines and unpacking each crowd favorite technology. First up is Holtec, which claims they are going to have the first small advanced reactor in the U.S. Holtec's new reactor, called the SMR-300, is set to be built on the property of a nuclear plant in Michigan called Palisades. Palisades closed in 2022, but it's being restarted, and hopefully by the end of 2025. As soon as the Palisades restart has been completed, Holtec's design, licensing, and construction team will get to work. They're planning to send a construction permit application, CPA Part 1, to the Nuclear Regulatory Commission, or NRC, by December of 2025, with a hope that construction will begin mid-2027. All of this, of course, is if the NRC actually likes it. Failures to deploy advanced nuclear have been primarily due to economic and business challenges rather than outright regulatory rejection, so we are crossing our fingers for Holtec. But then again, our favorite advanced nuclear technology is the one that gets built. Who's next? 